Hola, soy Ernesto. Uh, today we make a pan de muerto. I enjoy my daughter. Mariana, and we're making it for the Gaston County Museum. What you're going to need is one stick of unsalted butter, a half a cup of milk, a half a cup of water, five and a half cups of all-purpose flour, two packets of active yeast, one teaspoon of salt, one tablespoon of anise, a half a cup of sugar, a zested orange, two tablespoons of orange extract, and four eggs. Your first step is going to be adding the butter, the milk, and the water. into a saucepan on medium heat until the butter is completely melted. After you've taken the butter mixture off the stove, in a large mixing bowl, you are going to combine a half a cup of flour, yeast, Salt, anise, and the sugar. Then you are going to slowly beat in the butter mixture the orange extract the orange zest After that, you're going to take your four eggs and one at a time, mix each one thoroughly. Lastly, you're going to slowly add one cup of flour until the dough is soft but not sticky. Then you're going to knead the dough on low speed for 10 minutes. After you've taken your dough out of the bowl, you're going to separate it into two equal pieces. Next, you're going to take the two pieces of dough and separate it in half again. Now you should have four equal pieces of dough. You're going to take three of the pieces on dough and put it on a greased pan. These three pieces of dough are going to be rising for an hour until they double in size with wrapped plastic. Next, you're going to take the fourth piece of dough and wrap it in plastic to put in the fridge for later use. Now you're going to take the fourth piece of dough out of the fridge and separate it into different parts. One of the parts being inch thick round pieces of dough, 24 pieces of those, and 3 fourths inch round doughs, 
and you're going to need 12 of them. What you're going to do with these inch round pieces of dough is, is you're going to roll it like this. So it's in more of an oval long shape. Then you're going to take your fingers and create grooves into your piece of dough like this. And like I said, you're gonna want 24 of these pieces and they're gonna look like this. And you're going to save 12 of these pieces of dough. Now that we have 12 pieces of bread decorated, you're going to put them on a grease pan in the oven at a temperature at 350 for 25 to 30 minutes. Now after they're done baking and they're out of the oven, they should look like this. And your last step is going to be taking a brush and you're going to have some butter in a little bowl like this. And you're gonna brush it over it. And then you're gonna take a little bit of sugar to take a pinch and sprinkle it around the bird, like that. And you're just going to repeat the step for the rest of the pieces of bread. Thank, Thank you, you guys, guys so much, much for watching. watching. Adios. Bye. <laughs>